What is up my Irish Bagels and welcome to the first episode of Star Wars videos that I want to do and today guys I want to talk about is the Bad Batch which is an animated Star Wars show that takes place just when Order 66 happens and when the Republic changes to the Empire. Now in the second last episode of the Bad Batch titled Replacements when the Bad Batch are in hyperspace they are violently pulled out due to their capacitor being damaged causing the Marauder to crash on the Odor moon. During this crash Wrecker gets hit in the head which seems to have been a heavy blow which continued to stay with him throughout the group's mission. Any other kind of person you could say okay this is a really bad head injury but because Wrecker is a clone and he's a mutated one at that this could mean something much much worse. Because we all know that the Bad Batch's inhibitor chips did not work or give them the order to execute Order 66, which is to kill all the Jedi. At the beginning of this episode, we see Tech, who is their tech guy of the group, working on a device which has not been named yet, but we know that this will be a device to scan the inhibitor chips that are inside their heads. We already know that Echo, who we all thought had died in the Clone Wars, was basically turned into a machine by the Separatists. His inhibitor chip could potentially have been damaged or maybe even taken out, hence why he did not execute the order. We already know that the Bad Batch will be teaming up with Rex at some point in the show and we could see Rex help them to get their inhibitor chips taken out. Going back to Wrecker, we see that he hits his head off the support when they are crashing through the sky and he hits the side of his head. Now this is very important because if we remember from Star Wars Rebels when we saw Rex, Gregor and Wolf, they had their inhibitor chips taken out and to me it looks like all of them were taken out on the same side, the side that Wrecker hit when the squad finally hits the ground and crash lands we see they are moving around and Wrecker is actually holding the side of his head and you can see it is giving him quite some distress. Now the way Wrecker is acting is a lot like an episode in the Clone Wars series where Tops inhibitor chip malfunctions and has him execute order 66 early resulting in Jedi Tiplar being shot and killed and with the latest episode named Cornered we see Wrecker in the underground tunnels where Omega bumps into Wrecker and we see Wrecker is being flung into a control panel by Fennec Shand who is also in the Mandalorian who is a bounty hunter. We then see Wrecker get up and wobble a little bit and be kind of dazed like he does have a concussion and I think we may see Wrecker get hit some more times in the head and throughout this series and this could show us that Wrecker will execute Order 66 and you might be thinking to yourself which Jedi will he try and kill or which Jedi will he kill? Well in my opinion I think he may try and kill Ahsoka. You might ask why do I think this? Well simple really. Knowing the Bad Batch are going to be meeting up with Captain Rex and Rex was with Ahsoka at the end of the Clone Wars. We could potentially see Ahsoka having to kill Wrecker or Wrecker trying to kill maybe Omega. A big thing that could happen as well with Wrecker being so strong. And if he is executing Order 66, we could see the group killing him because he is too strong for them to stop. And this is quite possibly a sad outcome, which I hope does not happen. But yeah, this is the end of the video, guys. I hope you did like it. If you did, please hit the like button. Right beside that is the subscribe button that you can hit to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Beside that is the notification bell that you can hit to stay up to date whenever I upload a video. I also have a Twitch channel that I live stream to uh, weekly. Link down in the description below. Once you're there, you can hit the follow button and hit the notification bell to stay up to date whenever I go live over there. I also have a Twitter account that is linked in the description below. When you're there, you can hit the follow button. You don't have to hit the notification bell if you don't want to because I mainly just uh, kind of pump out random stuff 
and of course notifications at times as well if you want to follow me there you know where to go link in the description below i also have a discord link if you want to join it i spent a lot of time on it link to that will be down in the description below as well and yeah that's it guys hope you like favorite and subscribe and peace